I love Fun. Fun was a three-man indie band from New York. They exploded into popularity with their sophomore album Some Nights in 2012 before going their separate ways to various success. Nate Ruiz was the frontman, Jack Antonoff was on guitar, and Andrew Doss handled drums and everything else. I was in high school when We Are Young hit number one on the Billboard charts. I thought it was okay at first, then got kinda sick of it. Then I heard this song. Some nights I stay up cashing in my bad luck. Some Nights is one of the best songs to make the pop charts in the last 15 years. It's a powerful, crazy song hitting a whole gamut of emotions. After that, I gave the whole album a listen, I liked it enough to give their first album a listen, and just as I was getting into them, they were gone. Nate Ruiz tried doing a solo career, and it didn't work out for him. Jack Antonoff has his own band that's been doing well for himself, and he's done production work for other people, including Lord. So I think Fun has a lot of good songs on those two albums. They bop and swing and have a lot of influence from jazz and arena rock, whereas most other indie acts from the era just use an acoustic guitar and a drum machine. Fun always aim for the top. Their songs always feel massive and self-important. They were really ambitious when they were all together, and they certainly were at their best together. Jack Antonoff is a good writer and musician, but he can't really sing with much conviction. Nate Ruiz, on the other hand, is an amazing singer who can make getting drunk sound like the most important thing in the world, but without Jack and Andrew, his lyrics end up being even more incoherent and weird. And I don't know enough about Andrew Doss to make a judgment about him, but neither Nate Ruiz nor The Bleachers have drum work as good as those two fun albums. Fun certainly lives up to their name, batshit pretentious and over the top, high on their own narcissism, and greater than the sum of their parts. They made music from their soul and went all the way with it. They tried being a force of unbridled positivity in an industry that was about to crash and burn into mundanity. And that's why I love fun.